हेलो एवरीवन माय सेल्फ संजय उडगे असिस्टेंट प्रोफेसर डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ इलेक्ट्रॉनिक्स इंजीनियरिंग वालचंद इंस्टीट्यूट ऑफ टेक्नोलॉजी सोलापुर टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस इंट्रोडक्शन टू 8085 जीरो एट फाइव माइक्रो प्रोसेसर पार्ट वन आर्किटेक्चर लर्निंग आउटकम एट द एंड ऑफ दिस सेशन students will be able to analyze architecture of 8085 micro processor outline introduction 8085 micro processor 8085 architecture question answer references a micro processor is a controlling unit of a micro computer fabricated on a small chip capable of performing arithmetic logic unit operations and communicating with the other devices connected to it in this video we will discuss the architecture of 8085 micro processor basic micro computer the heart of this micro computer is micro processor that includes arithmetic logic unit a register array and control unit this micro processor is connected to the input device as well as output device and the memory so this comprises a micro computer microprocessor consist of an alu that is arithmetic logic unit a register array and control unit alu performs arithmetical and logical operations on the data received from the memory or an input device a register array consists of registers identified by letters like b c d e h l and the accumulator the control unit controls the flow of data and instructions within the computer so microprocessor consists of arithmetic logic unit register array and control unit for the temporary storage of the data 8 bit registers are used named as b c d e h l the control unit performs all the necessary control actions required for the execution of the program microprocessor working the microprocessor follows a sequence fetch decode and then execute initially the instructions are stored in the memory in a sequential order the microprocessor fetches those instructions from the memory then decodes it and executes those instructions till stop instruction is reached later it sends the result in binary to the output port between these processes the register stores the temporal data and alu performs the computing of functions so uh, in summary the working of the microprocessor consists of before execution uh, any single instruction we have to fetch that instruction which is stored in the memory location so this is been carried out by the uh, program counter the fetching instruct after fetching the instruction the instruction is being uh, stored in the instruction register as the name suggests instruction register it contains the instruction to be executed after the instruction has been loaded into the instruction register it is been decoded by instruction decoder and then uh, control unit performs the necessary actions uh, to activate the alu to perform logical operations to perform arithmetic operations and meanwhile 
the temporary data is stored in the register B, C, D, E, H, L and the accumulator. 8085 is pronounced as 8085 microprocessor. It is an 8 bit microprocessor designed by Intel in 1977 using NMOS technology. It has the following configuration 8 bit data bus, 16 bit address bus, which can address up to 64,000 bytes. A 16-bit program counter, 16-bit stack, stack pointer, 6 8-bit registers arranged in pairs B, C, D, E, H, L. It requires plus 5 volt supply to operate at 3.2 MHz single phase clock. It is used in washing machine, microwave oven, mobile phone ETCs. The examples given over here, washing machine, microwave ones, all these are programmable devices so that it requires the program to be stored. That's why we are using uh, 8085 microprocessor to perform uh, given uh, operations. 8085 microprocessor functional unit. Accumulator, it is an 8-bit resistor used to perform arithmetic logic input output and load store operations it is connected to internal data bus and alu alu that is arithmetic logic unit as the name suggests it performs arithmetic and logical operations like addition subtraction ending oring etc on 8 bit data General purpose registers. There are six general purpose registers in 8085 processor that is B, C, D, E, H, and L. Each register can hold 8 bit data. These registers can work in pair to hold 16 bit data, and their pairing combination is like. B C D E H L program counter it is a 16 bit register used to store the memory address location of the next instruction to be executed microprocessor increments the program counter whenever an instruction is being executed so that the program counter points to the memory address of the next instruction that is going to be executed so the program counter as discussed just now it holds the memory address location of the instruction next instruction to be fetched stack pointer it is also a 16 bit register works like stack which is always incremented decremented by 2 during push and pop operation it is a part of the memory temporary register it's 8 bit register which holds the temporary data of arithmetic and logic operations. Flag register. It is an 8-bit register having 5 single bit flip-flops which holds either 0 or 1 depending upon the results stored in the accumulator. These are the set of 5 flip-flops. Uh, each uh, flip-flop is assigned for sign then zero, auxiliary carry, parity, and carry. Sign flip-flop is set when the result is positive. That means it will uh, th that this flip-flop will have output equals to one. If it's a negative, it will be reset to zero. If the result is zero, this flip-flop will be set. If it if it is non-zero, it will be uh, logic zero. Auxiliary carry, if it is auxiliary carry is generated in the operation, then this uh, flip flop is set, otherwise, it is in the reset condition. Even parity for even parity result, uh, this flip flop is set, otherwise, for odd parity, it will be uh, store logic 0. And finally, if the carry is generated, this flip flop will set to 1, otherwise, it is reset to 0. Instruction register. 
and decoder it is an 8 bit register when an instruction is in fetched up then it has been decoded timing and control unit it provides timing and control signal to the microprocessor to perform operations following are the timing and control signals which control external and internal circuits control signals ready status signals dma signal reset signal interrupt control as the name suggests it controls the interrupts during a process when a microprocessor is executing a main program and whenever an interrupt occurs the microprocessor shifts the control from the main program to process the incoming request after the request is completed the control goes back to the main program there are five types of interrupts intr rst 7.5 6.5 5.5 and tap so this is the block diagram of a uh, architecture microprocessor 8085 uh, microprocessor that includes alu then interrupt control then 8 bit data bus 16 bit address bus in this lower 8 bit address bus is uh, used as a uh, data bus whereas higher order 8 bits that is uh, ad8 to ad15 these are used only for the address bus this is the uh, here it has been shown as a program counter this program counter holds the location and memory location of the next instruction is to be fetched then the instruction is been loaded into the instruction register then it has been decoded and after decoding the instruction the control unit activates the signals that will control the overall operation like logical operations or arithmetic operations these are the references thank you